If you want to implement a more agile way of doing performance management, think about how mature you are as a company before doing so, because not everything is right for everyone. So that's why we've created the scale of five steps of maturity before you can implement performance management. And so step one is when both HR and the management team are not convinced that anything needs to happen. You know, I've got this company that's on a yearly cadence and that's fine for me. I set objectives as a management team and everybody just has to get their objectives. And maybe if you don't, then you get that rough feedback once a year. And so that's maturity level one. Maturity level two is when the management team thinks like that, but HR doesn't. HR would, would prefer, you know, having those concepts like coaching, continuous feedback, um, ownership of your career, those kind of things. They would like to start implementing that. And what you need to do there as HR is to go talk with your employees, gather data, do some surveys and bring them to your management really convince them that by implementing this new kind of approach for performance management, we can really motivate the employees, get a high retention rate, get more performance out of that. You know, they have to realize that it's an issue right now. Then the third step of maturity is when the management team and HR are on board, but the middle management has no clue yet. So they need that kind of awareness phase that they need to invest in becoming a better leader, that they need to invest time in that. And so what you do there is you ask the right questions. That's the most important thing you can do there. Like, um, how does your team, how often do you talk with your team? What do you talk about, et cetera, et cetera. Make sure that, that you create awareness by asking those questions. And then step four is actually when the managers have the awareness, but they don't really know how to apply it. And that's the perfect time to offer them the right tools. And with tools, I, I don't just mean digital tools, but I mean this sort of common terminology. And that's, for example, a check-in. When you want to give feedback, if you want to give feedback, call it a check-in and then it becomes normal. Uh, set objectives to create cl clarity with employees, those kind of things. Then they know what they feel is necessary, all of a sudden becomes very concrete. And that's a very fertile ground to start growing this performance management thing. And then the fifth step of maturity, obviously, is when you're there, when everybody, you know, does continuous conversations, does give feedback, wants to grow themselves personally and gets help from their manager. And so when you're thinking about performance management before you launch a new experiment or experiment or before you dive in, make sure that you consider how mature you are first.